backflip off the backflip container into a into a stoppy. Can I bring it back into a moonwalk? Let's see. There we go. There's the moonwalk. Nice. We're just walking it back. Woo. Hello and welcome back, everyone, to another exciting episode of Two Candles Monster Jam Steel Titans One. <laughs> In the last episode, I unlocked Gravedigger Overcast, and I figured I would uh, play as Gravedigger Overcast for this episode. And I kind of wanted to run you through the uh, the process that I go through to, you know, when I unlock a new truck and uh, what I do to, like, upgrade it and uh, get ready to play some some uh, matches with Steel Titans. Whoa! Nice big jump right there. Big air! Oh, very slow backflip, but I did manage to land it. <laughs> Okay, so when I unlock a new truck, I come in here and change vehicle. I look at the vehicle and uh, we go ahead and we just add some. Now you can see up in the top right corner, you can see my upgrade tokens there. I have 125,000. So that's more than enough to get me to tier four on all of my, um, my engine parts here. Not my engine parts, but my car parts, truck parts. So let's start with engine. We'll go up to tier four and transmission up to tier four. Suspension tier four, tires tier four, and chassis tier four. And then we'll just, we'll go into it. Now, the reason why I go up to tier four and not to tier five is because sometimes when you place first, you'll get a free upgrade. And if you're in tier four, you'll get a tier five upgrade, which is worth uh, about 6,500, uh, depending on what it is, about, or average about 6,000 tokens. So I mean, that's a free 6,000 tokens just for finishing first. So it's worth it. Now, another thing that we've done, we've already gone through the entire career mode. We've 100%ed everything, world championships, stadium championship, stadium trials, arena, all that stuff. And we've gone through career mode plus, and we've 100%ed uh, all of those as well. We finished first in everything. We've also done a full tour of the entire map, which is a you know, relatively small map. This is a kind of, it's not a, a large game, but uh, you know, over here in the Titans Grove area, we've got Gravedigger, he's got some challenges and we have done all of Gravedigger challenges. We've got them all up to 100%. And then down here in the Vermilion Lake area, over here by the Soap Tree Inn, there's Max D, and we've got all of Max D challenges 100% completed. And then over here in the uh, Gecko Flats airfield area, right over here, there is El Toro Loco, and we've gotten all of his challenges completed 100%. So you might be asking too, Ken, what is there left to do? Well, uh, you know, there, there isn't much left to do other than to unlock new trucks and to level them up to 100%. So that is what I'm gonna do today is I'm gonna start unlocking and leveling up my trucks. Now, if you watched my guide on how to collect credits, the best, the fastest way to correct, collect credits in Steel Titans, uh, you will know that there are a couple different ways that are pretty fast. One way is to do the Caratail Rhythm Map. One way is to do two wheel skills. Both of those are pretty fast. But what I like, I like the, uh, the thrill of getting a free oh, truck for unlocking. And also I need a way to make some more videos. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do career mode again but we're gonna do the world championship. If we finish the world championship, I found through my testing that you will get a free truck at the end of the world championship. It takes a while, but it's worth doing. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna start over the world championship again. It gives you a little bit of warning saying it's resetting the progress. That's fine, just ignore that. Just say, yeah, that's fine. Moving on though, here we go. We have got Gravedigger Overcast. That's a nice looking truck. I think I like uh, Gravedigger Fire better. And there's Megalodon. I still say the graphics in Steel Titans 1, I don't know, something about the lighting. I like the graphics in Steel Titans 1 better than Steel Titans 2. What can I say? 3, 2, 1, and go. Just a good start. Now, tier 4 should be more than enough to finish in first place, but uh, it does look like my competitor here, Megalodon, is giving me a run for my money. These first tracks uh, where you're just going around in circles, the computer is able to t draw a tighter circle than I am usually. But sometimes I'm able to catch up. There we go. It looks like Megalodon had a little bit of a spill, so I am able to catch up and take the victory. Yeah, buddy. 
All right, first place. It looks like we're doing out of 16 this time around. That's fine. Next up, we're going to be going against Soldier Fortune, which out of the uh, the right side, who do you think we're going to go against in the finals? I'm going to guess Gravedigger the Legend. Either that or Max D. Uh, let's go with Gravedigger the Legend is my pick. Before we can face off against Gravedigger the Legend, though, we've got to blow through the rest of the competition. First up is going to be Soldier Fortune. Let's go. Now, it really does help on these first ones, like I said, that are going around in circles. If we can get a perfect start. Oh, that's an early start. Early starts are no good. Early starts give you a speed penalty coming out the gate. But I am slightly ahead of Soldier Fortune. Oh, no, he's taking the lead. Oh, man. Maybe the computer will mess up like it did last time. Oh, there we go. I've taken the lead a little bit. This is a tight, tight race. Come on. Come on, Grave Digger. You can do it. You can do it. Here we go. Here we go. Final stretch. Got it. Nice. Take that, soldier. <laughs> yeah, buddy. There goes Soldier Fortune. Toucan plays wins again. Next up, we're going to be going against Earthshaker, Grave Digger the Legend, and Pax T. Boy, did I call it or what? I'm still going to stick with Grave, Digger, Grave Digger the Legend in the finals. Let's see. Earthshaker. Hey, Tristan England is no longer going to be driving Earthshaker next year. That is so sad. But I like the new JCB truck that looks really neat. I, I do think it looks cool. Here we go. Three, two, one, and go. Just a good start. Man, my timing is off today. I'm a little out of practice, I guess. All right, here we go. Round and round we go. Salt Lake is just a big donut. Come on, come on. We got to beat Earthshaker. Yeah, just a little bit ahead. Oh, no, he's caught up. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. This is so tight. Neck and neck. Oh, we pulled ahead. We pulled ahead. Can we keep it? Yes. Oh, baby. <laughs> Give the crowd a little roll there at the end. <laughs> Nice, here we go. Two cam plays versus Earthshaker. Two cam plays wins. Oh, it's Max D in the finals. Let's go. Nice, here we go against Max D in the finals. Hey, do me a huge favor though before we get started. Smash that like button. It really does help get these videos out to more people. It lets me know that I'm doing a good job and that you want to see more Monster Jam Steel Titans action. And we got a perfect start. It's all because you smashed that like button. Thank you so much. Oh, come on. That perfect start gave me a nice little early lead. Can I maintain it? Can I maintain it? I think I can. Max D versus Gravedigger the Legend. I'm sorry, not the Legend. Gravedigger Overcast. Oh, our lead is getting bigger and bigger. We're catching up. We're almost going to lap him. Here we go. Nice win. <laughs> Woo. <laughs> That's right, baby. Toucan Blaze is your racing head-to-head -head champion in Salt Lake. Let's move on. All right, moving on to two-wheel skills. Now, I've kind of perfected two-wheel skills. If you've seen some of my other guide videos, you'll know that I have a pretty, pretty solid plan here. We're going to go and we're going to do a backflip. A yeah, big air sky wheelie with a backflip, and that should give us like four combo points. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Ooh, nice big jump there, and nice. Got that big air sky wheelie. Oh, almost made a double backflip. Didn't quite. Oh, come on. Keep that combo. There we go. Okay, we got a four times combo to start us off. It wasn't the prettiest thing in the world. Let's see if we could just do that again. All we need really is a six times combo, and that should be enough to put us into first place. Come on. We'll just stick with one backflip. There we go. Almost got a slap wheelie there. Now, sometimes we can uh, finish it off with, uh, oh, we didn't get first place. We only got second. <laughs> oh, man. You need to finish that off with a donut and a cyclone to get a six times combo. That'll that'll put you into first place right away. Yeah, I got a little greedy there looking for that double backflip. I should have known better. I should have known that I couldn't get a double backflip. But, you know, no risk, no reward. Let's move on to freestyle. Here we go. Grave Digger Overcast, one of the nicer variants of Grave Digger, I think. Here we go. Three, two, one, and go. Come on. Oh, I was so off. <laughs> Let's get a nice big air sky wheelie with that backflip. Oh, nice. Five times combo to start things off. Got a donut. A cyclone. Nice. Here we go. We'll come back around over here. We'll grab another beacon. And we'll get another backflip, big air, sky wheelie. Can we make it into a, whoa, almost got that moon flip in 
That was a uh, that was not what I was going for. I was just kind of going for a moonwalk, and it gave me that flip instead. Uh, this is the physics of Steel Titans one. It's a little cray cray. <laughs> no. Oh 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 oh! Slap wheelie. Okay, I will take a slap wheelie. Sure, sure, sure. Let's see if we can do a donut on the pod. Look at that! Look at that! Just spraying mud everywhere. <laughs> Okay, let's come down here. We'll get a nice stoppy moonwalk and a boom moon flip. Oh. <laughs> wow, the physics are so crazy in this game. All right, we're already in second place. Let's get this beacon. We'll come around over here in front of uh, Dragon and El Toro Loco. Get another beacon. And then we're going to hit the log stack and get a nice big air sky wheelie. Whoa. <laughs> Then let's come over here to the backflip container. We'll get a backflip off the backflip container. Let's see if we can make it a double. We did. Nice. Did not. We're not able to reverse it into the moonwalk. That's OK. Let's come over here. We'll get this one, too. Beacon backflip double. There. <laughs> I don't know what that was. I tried to go for a moon flip, but uh, <laughs> actually, I just wanted a moonwalk. That's all I wanted. But uh, physics and Steel Titans 1 are just a little cray cray. <laughs> I know I've already said that. All right. Time's almost up. We are well into first place. Let's see if we can collect this last little beacon here in five seconds. There we go. We got it. Off the tires. Oh. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. There we go. There's a, <laughs> a little bit of a moonwalk. I don't know. The flip flopping like a fish is so crazy in this game. Nice first place win, got a nice first place bonus. Did not get a part, but that's okay. All right, moving on to our next city. This is Anaheim, home of 2023's Superstar Challenge. Man, that was a good event. It just happened a couple weeks ago, and that was a lot of fun to watch. I really enjoyed the Nitro versus Neon theming. Wish they had made a few more trucks, Nitro and, and or Neon. First opponent's gonna be Captain's Curse here in Anaheim, California. Let's go. All right, so this track is a stadium track, so it's not a donut. It's a little bit more complicated. I remember I like this track a lot, actually. Yeah, it's the figure eight. And we come around this way. And we got to go all the way around. It, it's kind of a figure eight to start, and then it turns into a regular old loop-de-loop. -loop. And we got a nice little big jump at the end. Nice. Let's see if we can maintain our lead over Pirate's Curse here, or Captain's Curse. I'll get those two mixed up. I know Pirate's Curse has got the big skull on it, Captain's Curse does not, but still, I get the names confused. Pirate's Curse was in Series 32 of Spin Master Monster Jam, the toy line. If you haven't checked that out, I'm gonna put a link on the top right corner. That was a lot of fun to unbox as well. All right, Anaheim head to head, Toucan plays, beats out Captain's Curse. Next up is going to be Megalodon. And let's see, we've got Max D versus Gravedigger the Legend. Ooh, who's it going to be? I'm going to say it's going to be Max D again. And then uh, El Toro Loco Yellow versus Earthshaker. Ooh, semifinals are going to be a tight race, man. First off, we got to get through Megalodon, though. Let's go. There is Megalodon. Oh, that killer shark. <laughs> Here we go, three, two, one, and go. Nice, just a good start. Yeah, good start is good. I get a slight bonus for a good start. Not as good as a perfect start, but it's still a good bonus. Here we go, round and round. What's your favorite Gravedigger variant? Is it uh, Fire and Ice? Or Fire, rather? Fire or Ice? Is it Overcast? Is it uh, the new Nitro? That one's a pretty good one. I like the Nitro or Neon. The Neon was at the Superstar Challenge in Anaheim. I don't think they've had a toy for Neon Gravedigger yet. I don't know if they're going to. That would be kind of nice if they did. I have to say I like Nitro much better than I like Neon, but it was still kind of cool to see a different variant. Gravedigger is always fun to have lots of variants for. Nice, we beat Megalodon. 
Ooh, okay, so Dragon won out against Great Clips Mohawk Warrior. So the Dragon is who we're going to be going against in the semifinals. Max D versus Earthshaker in the semifinals. Let's go. Nice, Dragon. Dragon was my son's favorite truck for a while, and then he uh, he found the joy that is Son of a Digger, and that became his favorite. Son of a Digger is pretty cool. Three, two, one, go. Oh, I was so late. So late. <laughs> of course, I think... I think one of the big draws for Son of a Digger is the driver, you know, Ryan Anderson, man. You can't go wrong with him. Here we go. Oh, we're getting way ahead of Dragon. We're going to beat him. But, you know, Son of a Digger's got a nice look to it as well. But the driving skills really are what make the truck. That's why Grave Digger is so popular is because Dennis Anderson, Ryan's dad, made him such an icon. And they've always just had the best drivers on the planet driving Grave Digger. Adam Anderson, Charlie Pockin, Brandon uh, Vinson. Man, there's so many good drivers for Grave Digger out there. Nice. But for now, I am the best Grave Digger overcast driver there is. <laughs> of course, I'm one of the most humble overcast drivers, too. <laughs> Oh, wow. Earthshaker beat out Max D. Wow. So it's going to be me versus Earthshaker in the finals. Let's go. All right. Final round. There's that overcast skin and those giant BKT tires and Earthshaker, man. I'm so glad that they're keeping Earthshaker next year, too. I, I was worried they were going to get rid of it. All right. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Perfect start. Yes. Just got to slow my countdown just a little bit. Whoa. <laughs> what truck are you looking forward to the most next year? Is it the return of uh, Monster Mud Rottweiler? Is it the Marvel trucks? I know I'm looking forward to those Marvel trucks a lot. Is it the uh, the new JCB truck? The uh, oh, I can't remember the name of it now. But the one that looks kind of like a backhoe, a front loader, the one that Tristan England is going to be driving, that one looks pretty darn cool too. Let me know in the comments below, what is the truck that you are looking forward to the most in 2024? Woohoo! Nice. So Earthshaker is out of there. Two can plays is your Anaheim head to head racing champion. Hopefully I'll be the world champion too. Let's take a look at the standings. So I am four points ahead of Earthshaker. I, I'm surprised that Earthshaker is the one to beat. I thought for sure it was going to be Max D, but I guess not. So, hey, we're in a pretty darn good lead. Let's move on. All right, there is Gravedigger. That's grim on the back there. Gravedigger overcast, bad to the bone, baby. Here we go. Three, two, one, and go. Oh, not that it matters much on the two wheel skills. We'll get another big air sky wheelie into a slap wheelie. Oh, no, no, no. Don't flip. Don't flip. I got some cars. That gave me a nice little um, bonus there as well. Hey, hey, Gravedigger. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Here, let's see if we can uh, pop up. We'll get a bunch of these cars. Yeah, I got a four times car combo and then we'll come over here. We'll get a nice donut cyclone. No, it didn't count as a combo attempt because I couldn't get that cyclone in there fast enough. <gasps> oh, man, that's what I get for being cocky. You know, it happens every time. Every time I'm cocky about, oh, yeah, I've got uh, two wheel skills on, on uh, lockdown now. I know exactly how to do two wheel skills. <laughs> and then I fail every time. <laughs> I never haven't gotten first place yet. That's, that's God's way of keeping me humble, I suppose. <laughs> Moving on to a freestyle, though. Let's go. Grave Digger Overcast. Whoop, whoop. Wiggle those tires for good luck. Three, two, one, and go. Nice. Let's get a nice big air sky wheelie into a backflip. Whoa. -ho. I got a little bit of a slap wheelie there. They did not count it. A couple of car combos in there, too. Those cars actually can uh, can do a lot for your combo meter. You just got to get some points in there along with the cars. Whoa. <laughs> hey, there was a wheelie. They didn't count it. Rude. Judges. Judges. Whoa. Oh, that was a nice little backflip, followed by a bicycle, which they also didn't count. Big air sky wheelie off the log stack. Come on. There we go. Got it. 
Come on, let's go over here to the step up. Whoa, big air sky wheelie yet again. Oh, I keep trying to, oh, there's another bicycle. Oh, they did count that one, good. I was worried. Oh, backflip off the backflip container into a, into a stoppy. Can I bring it back into a moonwalk? Let's see. There we go, there's the moonwalk. Nice, we're just walking it back. Woo, that was a nice little sweet combo right there. We'll get another big backflip off the backflip container into that. Oh, not the same combo. Almost though. Hey, that put us into first place. Very, very nice. Oh, <laughs> that's the racing jammer right, right there. And whoa, geez, crazy combos. I can't even call them out. They're just so many crazy combos. We did get a nice bicycle, a backflip, a beacon, a slap wheelie. We got all kinds of weird combos in there. The physics in this game make for some interesting combos. I tell you what, man, I tell you what. Let's come right over here on this pod. We'll just jump up on it. And we'll just come right back down into the beacon. We'll come around over here to the backflip container. Oh, nice, a big air off that backflip container. That was a huge air off that backflip container. That is gonna be it for my freestyle run. I think that was a lot of fun. That was pretty darn good. All right, so that two wheel skills loss did hurt me quite a bit. I've lost, I lost two points toward, uh, off my lead. So now I'm only leading by three instead of five. Uh, that's okay though. Uh, Earthshaker seems to have floundered in the um, freestyle as well. So he's down quite a few points. Max D has overtaken Earthshaker as number two. It's still anyone's game. We're going to move on to Atlanta, though. We're going to do three cities per run this time. Captain's Curse is going to be our first competitor. Let's go. Here we go. Ready? Three, two, one, go. Perfect start. Very, very nice. Nice. So that, that perfect start gave me a good boost in the beginning here. And I've got an early lead against Pirate's Curse. Captain's Curse. Oh. Got to keep those two together. Oh, Captain's Curse had a meltdown. Something happened. He flipped out. I'm almost going to lap him, which would be great. I would love to lap him. <laughs> as long as I can keep him in my sight, that's good. So Atlanta looks like it's just another big donut, kind of like Salt Lake City. We're back to arenas. That's the way that the World Championship works. You go arenas, uh, stadium, arena, stadium, back and forth like that. Nice. Oh, <laughs> very good, very good. So Captain's Curse is out of the way. Next, we're going to be going against Zombie. That's the first time we've gone against Zombie. And uh, let's see, Earthshaker, Grim Digger's a Legend, Max D, Whiplash. I'm going to say it's going to be Earthshaker in the finals. Let's find out. Before we get to the finals, though, we've got to get through Zombie. Man, that's such a cool truck. I love Zombie. <laughs> Here we go, five, five, three, two, one, go. I was so late. My count was so off. I started with five. Why did I start with five? That was so weird. <laughs> oh man. So zombies, another truck with a ton of different variants. What's your favorite zombie variant? Leave a comment and let me know. Uh, mine, I gotta say is probably the, uh, the redneck or the dead neck zombie. I just like how his eyeball is popping out. <laughs> Second favorite is uh, the burn victim zombie, the red zombie. And of course, original zombie. Man, I lapped him. How did I lap him? He must have had a big wreck. Original zombie is, of course, one of the best monster trucks out there. <laughs> I just, I'm beside myself as how handedly I beat him. He is uh, not tuned for this as at all. Ooh. <laughs> All right, zombies out of there. Next up, we're going to be going against Megalodon. And yes, it's Earthshaker and Max D in the semifinals. I'm still going to stick with Earthshaker in the finals. Let's find out. Megalodon. All right, three, two, one, go. Oh, just a good start. I was off. At least I didn't start with five that time. <laughs> My good buddy, Mark Duenas, he's been a longtime supporter of the channel. He told me that this is actually a five count in Steel Titans 1 and not a three count. He's probably right. And that might have been why I started with the five count. But every time I've tried to do a five count, I always mess it up. I mean, not that I've been great on the three counts or anything, but uh, yeah, I don't know. 
I guess I have a, a, a old habits die hard. I'm used to doing a three count. Whoa, from Steel Titans 2. Of course, I started with Steel Titans 2 and now I moved on to Steel Titans 1. Oh, oh, big wreck by Megalodon at the very end. Megalodon's out of there and it's Max D in the finals, not Earthshaker. Max D is really pushing pushing it at the end here. He's uh, And it's Max D in the finals, not Earthshaker. Max D is really making a run for that second place slot, man. He's, he's pushing hard. That's okay, I kind of like having the competition. Tom Mintz, Max D, and it, that's kind of fitting having Tom Mintz versus Gravedigger, right? Max D versus Gravedigger. Oh man, early start. Come on. Oh, Max D has an early lead, but I'm catching up. I'm catching up quick. Did he spill it? He may have just had a, a rough corner, that's all. I don't think he lost it. I'm catching up real quick though. Here we go, coming around the corner. The rivalry of all rivals. Max D versus Gravedigger. It even beats out the uh, 32 degrees versus Buddhist rivalry that we've got going in our signup series right now. <laughs> Yahoo! Right over the top. Nice, so Toucan Plays is your Atlanta head-to-head -head champion. We have won, that's right, baby. All right, I'm after some redemption here in uh, two wheel skills. I want to show that I know what I'm doing. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> there we go. Nice big air sky wheelie. Oh, landed it. Let's do a donut. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. Got a nice three times, four times combo. Come on, let's get a nice another big air off the log stack. There we go. Another sky wheelie. I will take that six times combo that put us into first place. See, I told you I know what I'm doing. <laughs> Let's come around here on the log stack again. Oh man, come on, come on, come on. Get it, get it together here, Gravedigger. He keeps on wanting to pop wheelies and stuff. Now is the time for a wheelie. Nice, big air, sky wheelie one more time. Let's come around on this pod. There we go, got it. Not a sky wheelie, but nice jump. All right, let's see if we can finish this off with a cyclone. Oh, come on, they cut, they cut my combo short. Ah, oh, so rude. Hey, well, you know what though? We ended up in first place anyways, I'll take it. All right, here we are moving on to freestyle Grave Digger Overcast. Wiggle those BKTs for good luck. Here we go, three, two, one, and go. Come on, ah, oh, I was so early. Nice big air sky wheelie Whoa, into a little endo. They did call it a front flip. That's nice. Oh, come on. Keep that five times combo at the very least. Ended with a turtle. All right. Come on. Let's try this one more time. We'll get a nice beacon right here. We'll come around over here. I think what we're going to do is we're going to do a uh, stoppy and a moonwalk off the tires there. Very cool. We'll get a couple more beacons. And we're gonna hit this backflip container for one more beacon and a backflip. Not quite, just for a turtle. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> All right, come on, let's come around over here. We'll get a big jump off of that. Oh, didn't count as big air or anything else. Landed in a bicycle and a turtle. No, no, no turtle. Good, okay, got a wheelie. Oh. And a power out. They gave me the power. I'm not sure what the power out was for, but I'll take it. Nice big air sky wheelie off of the log stack. Let's come around over here. We'll get a cyclone and a donut. Spray some some mud all over Pirate's Curse over there in the back. And then we'll come around over here. Backflip off the backflip container. We'll make it a double. Oh! And they called it a barrel roll. I'm not sure where the barrel roll was in all of that, but it was enough to put me to first place. And then let's come around over here. We'll get the eight pack. Oh, now that is what I would call a barrel roll. And of course they didn't count it. Why would they, right? Why would they count that? <laughs> They're gonna count that power out? No, of course not. Why would they count the power out? Let's get a backflip off the backflip container. Make it a double. Can we make it into a, nope, no moonwalk. I was hoping for a moonwalk, didn't happen. Let's get a nice big air 
first guy, wheelie. <laughs> oh man! All right, we finished in first place. That was uh, that was one of the more wild runs that I've done, but it works. It was good. Thank you. Thank you very much. All right, now that's what I'm talking about. We're 10 points ahead of Earthshaker now. That's pretty good. Max D is in third, and he's four points behind Earthshaker. Uh, he's still giving Earthshaker a run for the money, but it's still a run for second place. <laughs> All right, but you guys know that I always like to end my uh, my episodes with an outdoor race. Today, we're going to do the old highway circuit race. This is one of those Max D challenge maps. This is the one with all the boosters on it. I remember this being quite difficult to get first place. Let's see how well I can do. So we've got a few Max Ds. We've got Max D Black, Max D Gold, Max D Regular, and then we got Zombie and Monster Mutt Dalmatian, and of course me, Grave Digger Overcast. Come on, let's go. Three, two, one, and go. Good start. Not a perfect start, just a good start. Now, there's a couple places on this track oh, that I remember are quite difficult to deal with. Oh. <laughs> okay, you, you stay over there, Monster Mud. I'll, I'll stay over here. I don't want to crash into you. Oh, flinging up the road signs everywhere. Nice. Okay, so we got a nice early lead. But if I recall correctly, I need to slow it down around this corner. Otherwise, I end up into the wall. Good. That was perfectly navigated. Hey, we're doing pretty darn good so far. It looks like we've got three laps we've got to do on this. That may be easier said than done. I might be doing well right now, but uh, who knows what we're doing later. Now, I think, if I recall correctly, there's an area up ahead here. Is it this one? Yes, it's this right here. If I hit those, I smash into the wall. <laughs> hey, nice. Okay, so it reset me real quick. That was good. I'm glad it reset me because I, that could have been bad. Oh, all right. Mental note, don't hit those boosters there on that end. Otherwise, it shoots me straight into the wall. Don't want to go flying into the wall there. All right. Lap one down. I'm still in first place, but I can hear them in my ear. They are right on my tail. Oh, man, we, we are cooking with gas. We've got so much speed going. All right. Remember, got to slow it down. Don't want to go flying into the wall. Perfectly done. Hey, you know what? I don't hear their engines anymore. I, I'm way out ahead of everybody. That's good, but don't get too cocky because things could change in an instant. All right, coming up. This is the spot right here. No, no, no. Oh, jeez. Ah. All right, come on, reset. There we go. Not too bad. Not too bad. Oh, I hear them again. They're on my tail. One more time. Oh, nice. Lap two down, and I'm way out ahead. I will take it. I like it. I'm feeling good about my my energy here. We've got good speed. We've got good tactics. Slow it down. Don't crash into the wall. Oh, gosh. That's what happens every time I'm cocky. Every time. I wasn't really cocky. I was just feeling good. I was comfortable. Uh, I hear them. The engines, they're in my ear. Oh, crash the, the wall again. No, 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 <laughs> no. Oh, come on. Come on. Oh, who is it? Is it Max D? A zombie. Zombie and Max D. No, I don't want to be behind Max D. No. <laughs> Man, we look like mystery mutters here. No. Third place. Third place. Oh, man. Third. We still got max point bonuses, though. Man, I was doing so good for so long there, and then right at the very, very end, I, I ended up biffing. Ah, what a bummer. Anyway, this has been a lot of fun. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video as much as I have enjoyed making it. Be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't done so already. Check out the video that you see on your screen right now, and hey, we'll see you guys whoa, on the flip side. <laughs> Later. Oh, my goodness. Crash. Oh, hey, I, I'm, I'm, I'm